welcome back to my channel so in this video i have decided to make a pair of dinosaur trousers um they're out of a fluffy material and i decided to give them to a friend of mine as she really likes dinosaurs and as we're sort of like not really doing anything at the moment we're in lockdown um i thought that would be like the perfect little thing to give a friend um so they're just some little track suits i would say um yeah so i'm gonna just go through how i made those i really hope you enjoy this video Okay, so as you can see here, what I'm doing is just cutting around the pattern that I had made. So originally I made this pattern from a pair of trousers that I owned. So I'm just cutting around those. In this next clip, I am just going to sew down the back of the trousers, so not the crotch area, but just like the seam of the top of the back, so they're kind of like a little bit high-waisted. So I'm just sewing that down here. Well, I did that on both sides, so I did the uh, front and the back of that bit. Now I'm just placing the legs right sides together and I'm just gonna pin them down in the inside and sew up in the inside. Once I've sewn along the inside, I then pin down the outside and I sew along that. I also did a zigzag stitch as well as um, a straight stitch just so they didn't fray because this was a very messy material it was kind of like snow everywhere but yeah it was just a mess but now in this clip what i'm doing is, is i'm just folding over some excess material that i have so i can make the cuff of the trousers And I'm just cutting that in half. I then pop it on the bottom of the trousers. Um, I did mess up on this bit and I wish I could redo it but um, so as you can see I actually sewed one bit first and then I did the inside and it didn't really work because obviously when I then took it out of the sewing machine it was all quite messy on the outside but you can really tell because I had the elastic there but um, in future what I would do is I'd fold them in together and then sew them so they're together instead of doing it how I did if that makes sense. Okay, so as you can see here, I'm kind of showing you what I, where I went wrong. So you can see that the, there's like two sort of seams on there and it just looks really messy. Um, so I would avoid doing that. I'm just doing it so you're putting them so they're in half, but one inside, one on the outside, and just sew them all together instead of sewing one side, then sewing the other. I don't know what I was thinking when I was doing this. 
I'm now doing like a waistband for the trousers so I'm just folding them in twice so then I can get that seam allowance in as well um, making sure obviously you leave a little hole um, so then I can thread the elastic in a little bit later on that was the same as also with the bottom so with the cuffs obviously I left like a little bit of a gap so I can thread the elastic through um, and then as you can hit see here I've actually uh, finished off and sewing the elastic in the trousers And here's the final look. Thank you for watching guys. If you enjoyed this video, then please give it a like and subscribe down below if you want to see more of my videos. And I will see you in my next one.